Hi all. In this video, I will explain how to create an Informatica mapping session and associate workflow. As we know, we use ETL tool to transform data from one source system to another source system. That is from one database to another database. Here in this example, I am transforming data from source database to target database. Here in source database, I am taking a table application type. Here it is the source database. I am running the SQL that is application type. In this table, we have six records application ID and application name. I am running the same SQL in target database. Here in target DB, we do not have any records. Here I am using Informatica transform, Informatica mapping. I am loading the source data into the target database that is in application type table. I am going to the Informatica power center designer. I have opened the test folder. Going to the source analyzer. Going to source. Importing from database. Here I have created ODPC data source connection from source and target databases. Here it is a source one and here it is a target one. I am selecting the source SQL server and connecting to it. Selecting the source table that is application type. Okay. And I am creating target database. Sorry, target table. Going to targets import from database here the odpc data source is set to target sql server connecting to it selecting application type table it is a target transformation and i am creating a mapping for this going to mapping create a mapping mapping name is m underscore test okay To create a mapping, we have to take the source source definition, source qualifier from the source tab. Here in the test folder, we have source folders. In this source folders, we have created a application type source transformation. Drag the source transformation to the mapping designer. Here it will show the source definition transformation and source qualifier transformation. We can edit the source call fair transformation. Going to the properties, SQL query. Here the no no query is defined here. Means we are pulling complete data from the source application type table. Here in this SQL we can put our required SQL to bring the required set of data and. Dragging this target application type into this mapping designer. Here it is our mapping application type one is the target definition. To map source call fair to application type target transformation, we have to select the fields and drag those fields to the respective column into the target transformation. Here we can observe that application ID is mapped to the target definition application ID and application name is mapped to the target application name. We can order these transformations by selecting arrange all. I am saving this mapping by pressing Ctrl S. Now I am going to create a session for this mapping. Going to the workflow manager. Going to tasks in task developer, creating a task session. I'm giving a session name as m s underscore m underscore test create. It is associated with the our mapping that is m underscore test. Okay, then if we go to the connections. Here it is a relational connection. 
we have to specify a relational connection for our required databases that is source and target here i have created these two connections for source and target if you do not have any connections here we can select by selecting this new going to this mapping session properties go to mapping gap connections here the connections are by default set to the db web database and changing these connections to this is a target one and this is a source file for application type is a source one source one selecting okay and it's under so session connections source connection value is setting to the source database and target connection value is and setting it to the target database selecting okay now i have updated the connection to this session and i am creating a workflow for this session going to workflow tab workflows create a workflow and giving the workflow name as mw underscore test we can schedule this workflow as we when we want to run the workflow for now i am creating a just a workflow to run manually I am dragging this s underscore m underscore test session to this folder. And joining these two tasks by line task. Here I have created a session s underscore m underscore test and included the session in this. map workflow that is w underscore test i am saying i am saving the workflow to run this workflow select the workflow w underscore test and right click on it select to start workflow it will show the status of this workflow in workflow monitor here i have run this workflow just now 1236 sorry this is a 114 the 14 time the session is succeeded successfully we can verify the data in our target database here is application type here i am selecting the target database running the sql here we can see the six records which are existing source database we can verify we can cross check the data source.dbo. application type If I six records in source database, I'm running the target database. Target running SQL here in target database. We can observe these source six records are loaded into the target database. We can also verify the session of this mapping by right clicking on the session get session log. This is the session log for this mapping. in the last session load summary we can observe that in the source sql source call for application type we are getting six records from source and this is from source load summary and in target load summary these six records were loaded into the application type target table here output rows are six affected rows are six updated rows are six and rejected rows are zero if we are seeing any rejected rows here that means those records are not loaded into the our target table means those records are rejected by our transformation those are will those records will be available in bad file here we can in mapping in application type we can see the bad file name that is application type 11 bad file with a dot bad extension in this file the rejected records will be stored now we do not have any rejected records since the file is empty here the session log will contain all our source and target connection types and source and target load summary details
दिस इज हाउ वी आर क्रिएटिंग ए मैपिंग सेशन एंड वर्क फ्लो इन इन्फॉर्मेटिका थैंक यू ऑल इफ यू हैव एनी क्वेश्चन यू कैन रीच मी एट संतोष डॉट गुनाला एट जी मेल डॉट कॉम एंड माई कॉन्टैक्ट नंबर इज नाइन डबल फोर डबल वन थ्री जीरो वन सिक्स जीरो थैंक यू ऑल